Hey, what's up guys? I'm just posting a quick video to point out a very interesting unidentified flying object that I noticed in the recent four hour footage that we got back from Elon Musk's red convertible that he launched into space just a few days ago. So the video is in a smaller window just to show you real quick that this is the official YouTube channel of SpaceX that I'm showing you. And this is just the raw footage of a little over four hours that we got back from the car. Um, so I'm going to maximize it and check out the timestamp. Um, this is a few seconds before the UFO is going to appear at precisely 2.05.24. That would seem to be the exact moment that it appears. Um, also, keep your eyes in this general area because that's where the UFO first appears. And check it out, see what you think. All right, you must have noticed it by now. Everyone's first impression is probably that this object seems to be flashing, and that's what first caught my eye about it. Um, and what's really interesting is that the longer it's on screen, it becomes increasingly clear that this object is not only just flashing, it is doing so in a regular pattern of flashing and then not flashing for a few seconds each time. And this is exactly the same way that an airplane flashes its lights when it's flying uh, for a few seconds of flashing, a few seconds of not, and so on and so forth. So this is flashing just like an airplane. So that was my first impression that it looks just like a very distant airplane on a very dark clear night. Um, and then I thought as a second impression, well, it actually seems even brighter than that. Um, even though it looks just like that, it seems even brighter than that would look under the most ideal conditions. So now the object is leaving the screen. I'm going to uh, jump back to its appearance one more time. All right, um, the object is appearing again. So I've already described its flashing and the regular way that it's doing so. And it's a big reason that it looks just like an airplane, um, except brighter. Um, now the other very interesting aspect about this object is that it seems to move through this view uh, with three distinct stages of its movement and I don't know if everyone has noticed this already um, but it seems to have three distinct uh, stages of its flight or movement um, right now it is curving upward and off the screen until it's gone and that's the third of the three uh, stages so I'm actually going to uh, jump back while I'm describing that to you um, but I will say that unfortunately when it's in double speed which will help bring out the movement of this object unfortunately that's also going to lose the natural appearance of its flashing so um, I do understand that a lot of people a lot of skeptics are going to dismiss this as nothing more than the uh, turning of an inanimate object which just happens to have a reflective spot on its surface. For example, it could be a, a chunk of rock and ice that uh, just happens to be shining in one spot and if it's turning while it flows through space then it could create a similar effect. So I just want to say that I understand that idea and I agree that it could create reflections in a regular pattern like this if it's turning just right. But I gotta say, uh, just look at this object. It doesn't seem remotely natural. Um, the, the flashing seems completely too bright and completely too regular uh, to resemble anything other than a very bright artificial light or lights on this object. So I'm going to kick it into double speed in a, in a second just to uh, bring out the motion of this object. And like I said, we're going to miss this amazing uh, video of its flashing just like an airplane. All right, so I'm going to do that right now. Okay, it's at double speed, and I'm going to bring it back to the appearance of the object now, and it's at double speed. Um, as you can see, the flashing looks a little bit less dramatic now. Uh, but the movement should be a little more clear. That's the first of its stages curving down into view. Second of its stage is 
flying straight across the screen as we see right now, and then the third is curving up off the screen. Three distinct stages.